Well, um, they're the sort of victories that um, can give you a lot of confidence. Obviously, it was a special one, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. I think, uh, you know, we come from 1-0 down and uh, and then uh, were we 2-1 down? Yeah, and then we're two on down, and then you know to to come back and score some good goals and be and be clinical. How we were, uh, you know, the previous week we had a lot of chances, and didn't score. As this week we um, we took our opportunities, and you know it was a, it was really positive moving forward. And as I say, this time the pointy end of the season, what can you take out of it above and beyond the three points? Um, I mean, obviously it was a big three points because Adelaide were on similar points to us. Um, and you know, moving moving forward, you know, it was uh, well documented about our a couple of bad losses previously, and we've moved on from that, and we're playing well. And um, you know, I suppose there's a couple of defensive things that we could have done better last night. But all in all, you'll, you'll take a victory out of that. Absolutely. Um, Guy Finkler was, was one bloke who certainly really stepped up. Do you have a bit of a point to prove after missing out on that? Um, no, I think he's. You know, you're always going to give 100, percent and that's what he does. And he's been patient in um, coming back from his injury, and um, he had to ride his time on the bench and. Now he's back playing, and he's um, you know he's been fantastic for us as he was before he got injured, and um, you know I think he's he's just enjoying his football at the moment, and performances are showing that. I mean, it was a real roller coaster last night. I mean, do you get you enjoy those those victories even more? It was really special. Yeah, I think so. I think um, you know it's it's probably a good game for the neutral as well, and then um, you know home fans obviously we finish with the win, and you know it's. Uh, I suppose, and then them getting one back towards the end of the game made it made it a nervy finish. So you know, it was a good spectacle, I think, and um, you know, I think I think fans would have gone home very happy. In terms of the schedule, it's going to be hectic uh, the next week or so, uh, yeah. travelling to China and then and then the derby. But you've got to look, to look forward to it and embrace it, I guess. Yeah, that's that's exactly it. You know, we you know we strive to be in this competition. So when you have to travel and do whatever and play midweek, there's no point complaining about it because it's it's where you want to be. You want to be playing in these competitions because it's the best competition you can play in, in in Asia so it's it's something that we're, we're looking forward to and um, you know yeah it is going to be tough but uh, you know that's what we're paid to do and um, you know I think everyone's just really looking forward to it. Have you got any update on uh, Tom Rogic's ankle this morning? Um, no I'm not sure he just had his foot in a big ice bin and it didn't look too bad so hopefully he'll be he'll be okay and um, you know it shouldn't be shouldn't be too long an injury.